This is number 19 on page 5. This problem is talking about state functions. It's worth talking about for a moment what a state function is and uh, what is not a state function. I wrote out a list here of things that are, to my knowledge, state functions. We talk about this is in the standard state, this gas is in standard condition, standard state, conditions. When we're talking about gases and standard conditions, we're talking about uh, of temperature and pressure usually. Notice if you change the temperature, it affects the gas, um, it, it affects the volume, the density, the viscosity of a gas. It affects everything else. Pressure also changes these other things. If you heat up something, it changes the viscosity. As you know, for example, honey, if you get it hotter, it becomes less viscous. The density of things changes also with temperature. So these are all uh, related to the fact that if you, if you, if you have these functions uh, or properties of matter, you have to specifically state the conditions upon which you've got these things. That's also true of our enthalpy, our entropy, and our Gibbs free energy. This little symbol here means that it's in standard state conditions, which means you have to state what the temperature is, what the pressure is, and so forth and so on. So these are places on the map, so to speak, that are fixed, and you have to say exactly what the GPS coordinates are for these things. It's at, you know, this given temperature, this given pressure, blah, blah, blah. On the other hand, there are some things that are not state functions. Uh, the first th ones that come to mind to me are heat, which is the symbol Q, and work, which is the symbol W. Q and W, these are not state functions because it doesn't matter. Uh, this is more like, if this is a map, these two things would, would be more like the trail that you travel to get from point A to point B would be heat and work. So uh, the trail to get from here to there is, is, is not a state function. The destinations are the state functions like you see here. Uh, how could I describe that for you? You know, let's say you've got, um, you know, a battery or something and you short circuit the battery, you could release a lot of heat, you may not do much work, but these these are both pathways to get from specific state functions. So in this problem on number 19 it uh, mentions temperature, mentions density, mentions work, mentions viscosity, but of course the one that's not a state function would be the work. So the answer should be C in this problem.